There's breaking news just coming in. Forces have thwarted intrusion attempt by Pakistan BSF troops to detect drone intrusion from Pakistan on 21st of night in Pirozpur sector district Tarantaran, following which BSF troops fired heavily on the flying drone. The area was called North. Search for the drone was conducted today morning. That is this morning, I beg your pardon. BSF troops recovered a drone in a farm. Further search in progress to recover contrabands as well. That's the latest coming in at the moment. Uh, we'll get you our reporters to bring you up to speed with the very latest this morning on what has uh, transpired as far as the Pakistan intrusion bid is concerned. The BSF troops, as I just mentioned, detected drone intrusion from Pakistan on the 21st of December, that is uh, last evening. Um, at Pirozpur uh, sector, district Tarantaran, following which BSF troops fired heavily on the flying drone. The area of course was cordoned off. Search for the drone was conducted this morning. The BSF troops recovered the drone in a farm. What next is something that our reporter will be able to get us up to speed with. But uh, there is further search in progress right now. This search is meant to find the contraband also. We'll get you the latest on this story and keep a close watch on this Pakistan intrusion. Uh, Bit Kamaljeet is now joining us for the very latest. Kamaljeet, any kind of findings as the search is in progress currently to recover contrabands? Uh, you know, around 8 o'clock, this is when uh, BSF had actually uh, spotted the drone and it was shot down. Uh, but as the year draws to an end, uh, the number of drone sightings has significantly gone up at the Indo-Pakistan border in Punjab. And what is important and significant is that these are sectors which is Firozpur, Fazilka, Amritsar. Uh, these are significant sectors. And these, uh, and you know, yesterday also uh, Rajiv Shukla, member of parliament from the Congress party, had raised that particular question in uh, Rajya Sabha. What is also significant is that there are a number of weapons which are being dropped. There is also drugs which are being dropped in. And this is not just uh, for, for Punjab itself. It's going way beyond uh, the borders of Punjab into the hinterland and that seems to be a cause of concern. One, that Pakistan ISI is trying to revive extremism in Punjab including Khalistani activity. The other is obviously uh, they want to disrupt peace and uh, uh, prosperity in the state. And uh, despite uh, Punjab faring pretty well as far as law and order situation is concerned, the border area is, 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 is something of a major concern. This year alone, we know that around uh, 220 uh, drones have come in, both in Jammu as well as in Punjab. Uh, at least 20 drones have been downed. Uh, most of it is in Punjab. But clearly, uh, as far as efforts from the Pakistani side is concerned, they are very much up. And that is why there has to be a high level of vigilance. You would remember uh, some years ago, uh, the Pathan Kot air base attack took place new the, near the New Airs. So this time also, there are intelligence inputs that Pakistan is trying to disrupt peace. Uh, the vigilance is up and that is why there are joint patrollings being conducted both by the BSF, uh, which is the first line of defense, and Punjab Police, uh, which is the second line of defense. We've been told uh, that the village defense committee has been revived so that the villages are roped in. And if they feel that they are spotting any suspicious activity, uh, they can immediately inform security forces and they can, they can bring in. And the, obviously the anti-drone activity or, or uh, mechanism which has been put in place is seen to be paying dividends now with a number of drones being downed, uh, especially in the last particular... All right, Kamaljee, thanks so much for joining us with the very latest details.